everybody great rising it is time for your rising reading and today we're using the animal dreaming spiritual oracle cards this is my first first day my first first day i love them so how did everyone sleep after that resting reading after we talked about balance knowing the difference between your personal balance and what you need to conquer personally. Some of y'all need to rest. Some of y'all need to add some action. But whatever it may be, know your balance. I always, always know your balance. My lighter is like playing with me. Like I can see the smoke, but it is not a lot of smoke coming out. Oh, gosh. It's like it's lit, but it ain't really lit. I see something coming out. Maybe it just ain't that much energy around. I heard that. All right. Let's add some palisantos. Let's add some positivity back onto these cards. Because that's what it's all about. Because not trying to be funny, but it's that. Thick joint you firing up. Girl, no. This is not no joint. <laughs> I'm done with you, Brittany. You know this ain't no joint. That is sage to clean your spirit, girl. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's funny. But yeah, so that probably Santos working. Real nice. Y'all see that? Real, real nice. I like that. All right, y'all. So let's get started. Let's see what energy we need to harness today on this Saturday. What vibes we need to be feeling. What vibes we need to be taking in from uni. Deception. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. The owl. Deception. Y'all. When I see this card, because this is a universal card, owls mean deception everywhere. All over the world. And these are Australian animal cards. So, when I see this card, I automatically think negative. I'm not even going to lie. I automatically be like, somebody out here trying to get me. Somebody out here playing like they really down for me, but they really not. That don't even be the case. Deception can mean, in a positive light as well, deception can mean you're looking at something from a negative point of view. And you've deceived yourself to think it's going to be negative. But it's actually going to be something positive, you know? So it's like, okay, energy, I'm done. But <sighs> that old owl. Uh, owls are night animals. So owls can see their best during the darkness. And you guys know the darkness represents your inner, your innate feelings, how you feel. So you take the owl to navigate you through the things that have been deceiving you. Even though you don't want to look through that darkness, you take that owl as your guide. And the owl will give you wisdom, will show you like, hey, this is not your best intention, baby girl. It's going to show you the truth. And a lot of people don't like the truth. That's the thing. The truth we can be so hard on ourselves that the truth hurts because we know we're going to sit there and bash ourselves for even going through these things. But when you forgive yourself and you can say, okay, I can stand in my truth, that's when you know, like, you've reached ultimate humanity. You know what I'm saying? You're reaching forgiveness of self. you reach reached self-love because you know you can stand in your truth. And the owl, man... She's wise. She's really, really wise. She's a night creature. I'm going to read some from the book. But deception, it can be positive or negative. And then her number is four. Four is a masculine energy. It represents practicality. It represents building. It represents foundations. Everything that has, a, like houses, they have four corners. See what I'm saying? It's the north, the south, the east, and the west. So you want to look at everything from every angle. That is definitely what I get from the owl as well. Look at everything from every angle and see if this is the best situation for you. So it says, if owl has slightly swooped into your cards today, you are being cautioned that you are perhaps being deceived by the apparently innocent motives of another. Owl's appearance may be a warning that you need to quickly ascertain the integrity hidden behind these motives and determine how many 
I'm sorry, determine how they may affect or influence your view on the world. The owl has been the owl has been gifted with clear night vision, which when employed with the right intentions, offers us the ability to see what others may miss. So you want to hit all four of those corners, you know what I'm saying? Hit all four of the aspects, hit all four of those situations. You want to look at every angle. Is this the best thing for me? Not nobody else, but is this the best thing for me? Mom. We are Mama Garage your office. It's all cooled out because it's a come up. But you want to, um, what was I saying? Oh, you want to look at everything from every corner, like really, really, really from every corner. See how everything is going on because you don't want to keep being deceived. A lot of times we even deceive ourselves like, girl, yeah, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, this the one, he the one for me, this the job for me, this the, this the situation for me. But really, it's just you settling. You really settling. And... I'm done, mom. I'm done. But you really settling. And that's not what you want to do in your life. Like, why do you even deserve that? You know what I'm saying? So, find everybody's motives that are around you. And if you've been questioning it, sis, you might be being deceived. Because you got to check all four of those corners. You got to check everything. Make sure everything is everything. Make sure everything is what you want it to be, what it's going to be, what it should be, how it's going to play out. You're not going to know everything for sure, but you want to make sure you can see every possibility that's coming. Be aware of every possibility. The miracles, the practicalness of it, just be aware of everything because you never know how anything is going to play out. So... That's the card of deception. Don't be deceived, guys. Take this night owl with you. Let her guide you to wisdom. Let her guide you to realness. And y'all stay up. Have a beautiful, 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 a beautiful, beautiful, <laughs> have a beautiful, beautiful Saturday. And don't forget, $5 readings are still going on. I'm going to let it go on through Monday. I might as well because y'all be playing. Y'all need this reading. But... They're still $5 all the way till Monday. So DM me and let me know if you guys want to do one. Or you can just go on the website and go ahead and book a consultation. They're not The consultations aren't required like the rest of the readings for any of my specials. But if you guys do have questions or you do want to just do the consultation, go ahead and do that because it is free. So with that being said, have a lovely Saturday. Lovely, lovely, lovely Saturday. And I will see you guys here tonight. Tonight, I don't know why I'm thinking I'm doing a wrestling reading. I will see you tonight at, we're going to say 9 Central. We're going to say 9 Eastern, I mean. No, I'm Central. I'm Central. Yep, I'm Central now. I'm Central now. Ain't I? Are we Central? Are we Central? No, we Central. We Central. Okay. All right, y'all. Bye.